all across Milwaukee County, sirens like this one are only supposed to sound during tornado warnings and routine testing. That's why a hack would cause so much confusion. Just last year, hackers hijacked the siren system in Dallas, Texas. More than 150 of them blared for 90 minutes. How real of a problem do you think this is, especially in today's day and age? Um, I mean, it's, it's a, of serious concern. After the Dallas attack, Milwaukee County determined its sirens were just as vulnerable. But yesterday, that changed. We felt that we needed to protect ourselves. All 57 sirens across the county have been outfitted with new technology. When workers at the 911 center activate them, that activation signal is now encrypted. So the transmission is basically sent in a code. Yes, yeah, you could say that. The company that installs and maintains Milwaukee County's sirens developed the encryption technology right after the Dallas hack. The goal? to protect older model sirens from tampering. Of course, you know, 20, 30 years ago, not many people are using computers or like, you know, things have changed over the decades. Milwaukee County hopes the extra security will keep its warning system credible. We don't want to be uh, the person that cries wolf. The county will be testing the sirens in the coming days just to make sure they're working properly. The total price tag on the upgrade, about $47,000. In Milwaukee, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4.